hello guys welcome back to my channel thank you guys for liking and sharing and subscribing to my channel yes it means a lot to me guys i'm here to do reading for the collective here you know let's see what the energy is coming in here guys i was picking up on a message here from spirit where i see this person here <laughs> this person have the hearts for you guys I'm telling you, this new person in your life here, guys, you turn this person on without even trying. I'm telling you, guys, this person is turned on by you naturally. Yes, naturally, this person is turned on by you. You don't have to do anything extraordinary here. I'm telling you, guys nothing extraordinary you excite this person yeah you excite this person here you know they're crazy about you let's see who the, we're dealing with here guys or this person what's the energy hold on guys Sorry about that, guys. Yeah. This person is naturally turned on by you, guys. Let's see who we're dealing with here. What's the energy we're dealing with? What's going on with this person? Their intention and the outcome. We have the seven of, seven of wands here. So I'm seeing somebody's, like, defending something here. Wow, the Empress. Yeah, somebody's defending this Empress here, guys. I'm telling you, they're fighting off like competitors or, you know, other people. <laughs> yes, I'm telling you guys, whoever this person is, you could be dealing with a fire sign here. But I'm telling you, this person is like defending this Empress. The Empress is somebody who is abundant here. You know, she have no problem manifesting abundance here, guys. Yeah, she know how to live the abundant lifestyle here. She's very lucky. You know, I'm telling you. Anything that she puts her mind to here, she, she manifests with it, manifest it with ease. <laughs> and we also have the nine of wands here. Wow. I'm definitely seeing this empress is being protected here. She's being protected here, guys, spiritually. In fact, she have a whole spiritual team around her. You know, this could be you or this person here. Excuse me, yeah? This person is defending you. She's standing their ground here. They're not giving up. This person is like a warrior, a fighter here, a strong warrior here, guys. Are you definitely, are this person definitely have a whole, you know, spiritual team around them, protecting them, defending them? And we have the strength card. Yeah, could be dealing with a Leo here, also Taurus with the, the Empress here, Major Arcana. Also, the, 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 the strength card, which is somebody who is very strong here. Whoever this person is, this nine of wands here, guys. The seven of wands. There's a lot of fire here. Somebody's definitely fully protected here, guys. <laughs> this could be somebody who is rich. This is somebody who is rich, and this is like bodyguard. This person has somebody definitely protecting them. Yeah, she's like seated on a throne here. 
I'm telling you, this is somebody who could also be like royalty. Yeah, this is somebody who is royalty. They hold a lot of power here. <clears throat> this is somebody very strong, very powerful here, guys. You're dealing with. And we have the high priestess. Wow. Yeah. I'm, I'm definitely picking up on the feminine energy here. You know, where she's been protected by this this masculine here. I'm telling you, this person knows something here. The, the high priestess. Pisces energy here, guys. You know, what? Fire and water. Yeah. And, and the... the, the the Empress, which is Taurus, Libra. I'm telling you guys, there's somebody who's very intuitive here. They have inner knowledge here, inner wisdom. Yes, guys. They get them download from spirit. And we have the two of wands here. And the nine of cups. These cards flipped over here. So this person already know that you're the one who brings so much happiness in their life here. Yes, I'm telling you guys. They already they're making a decision here to come towards you guys. I'm telling you, you turn on this person here. There's a lot of fire in this reading. You know, we have the nine of fire here. And the two of fire, but that is the eleventh eleven. 1s plus the 7 of 1s, 18 ones. Wow, that's a lot of fire here for somebody to have here. This person holds a lot of power, a lot of authority here, guys. This is somebody who is wealthy. You know, they're living in abundance here. You know, this is somebody who, you know, step into their dreams here. They're about to step into their dreams. They're making a decision here. They already know what they want here. Intuitively. Yeah. And the nine of cups. It's like their wish has come through. With this empress. Or this empress wish has come through here. They have found somebody who is like. A protector. Somebody who is going to be there for them. Stand up. Dedicated here. And we have the judgment right on top of the Empress. So this is somebody who is definitely like awakened here. Rising up. Rising out of the ashes here. Rising out of this coffin. And sitting up. Look at this Empress here. You rising up here guys. You've been pushed. You've been urged to move forward here. But first, you have to make this wake-up call here. You have to answer this call here. Whoever this Empress is, your wish is about to come true here. And we have the Moon card here. Pisces energy here with the... With the Moon card. yeah so i'm definitely seeing something here from the beyond here guys you know i'm seeing both of you guys this person want to be romantic with you i see you guys gonna be like looking at the moon watching the moon here yes i'm telling you all the stars they want to do this with you we have the harrison yeah this person is thinking marriage here. There's a new opportunity that's coming in here, guys. This high priestess already know this. You know, this 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 page of pentacles is right on top of the high priestess. Yeah, a younger earth sign here. 
Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Earth and water. Yeah, earth and water and fire. We haven't gotten any sword card yet, guys. No swords card here. This person could be even protecting you from afar here, guys. I'm telling you. They see you as the one they want to spend their life with. They see you as somebody who is very strong. You know, you're able to overcome any situation. You're a fighter. You're a warrior. And I'm seeing where some opportunity have been presented to you. This is somebody with some form of title here. Some form of, you know, <coughs> authority here. This could be like a spiritual teacher here. They listen to their intuition. Yes, I'm telling you. <coughs> Excuse me. Whatever opportunity this is here, guys, you're about to plant the seed. And it's going to help you to move forward here. You know, this is somebody about to step into something new here. Yes, I'm telling you guys, you could also be traveling here. With the two of wands in the chariot. Yeah, somebody definitely could be traveling. You're upon the verge to travel in here. You could be looking to places where you guys want to go. The chariot card, which is the cancer card here. You know, you could be dealing with a cancer or you have cancer in your chart. We have the Page of Swords, the Fool card, Knight of Pentacles, the Seven of Cups, the Nine of Pentacles. And the Temperance card. The Temperance is right on top of the, the Chariot here. So I'm definitely seeing somebody about to move forward here, guys. With their gift, their talent here. This is somebody who's like out of this world. You know, I'm telling you guys, Sagittarius energy here. Yeah. The, first, the only source card we have, the first card we have is the, the Page of Pentacles. This is somebody who is like figuring something out here. You know, they don't know everything as past, as yet, but they're figuring something out here. <laughs> you know, I'm telling you. They're definitely figuring something out. They're, they're doing some form of investigation here. They're watching. They're watching and they're learning. And we have the full card here. Yeah, so I definitely see you're going to be moving forward here. You know, whether this is you or this person, they are ready to take a leap of faith. <laughs> yeah, they're ready to take a leap of faith here, stepping into something new, a new era here. This could be this empress here. New beginnings, new start here. You're entering a new, a new, a new era in your life where you haven't been before. Yeah, it's something you've been learning about here. You've been learning about this. Something that gives you a lot of happiness, a lot of joy. You know, and it's making your wish come true. You're feeling the love of life again. You're defending what you have created here. You're defending, you're protecting what's yours. You're standing up for yourself here. I also see, you, you know, you're putting up boundaries here, guys. You're putting up boundaries here. We got a major. We have the the hype, the, the empress, the judgment, the fool card, the moon card, the strength card, the hierophant, the high priestess, the chariot. You know, and we also have the temperance card. A lot of major arcana here, guys. So I'm definitely seeing things are definitely changing here. You know, I'm telling you. Whatever is meant to be, 
it is being happened here i see a new opportunity that's coming in here guys this could be like you know financially here where you're going to be successful here you could have already planted the seed here whatever this is this could be a new job a new paying job here and you could have start your own business here it's being self-employed yeah there's something that you're doing here guys Something that you're doing here that's gonna land you, lead you success here. You know, something was hidden from you with the Seven of Cups. Somebody was hiding something. Uh, you know, hiding could be hiding from this person. We have the, the Queen of Pentacles, Justice, the Six of Cups, the Three of Cups. So I see new connections coming in here, guys, new people. You know, there's a lot of love here, a lot of connections here that's coming in for you with the Three of Cups here. Moving out of the Seven of Cups to the Three of Cups. Energy. Where I see there's going to be celebration here. You know, I'm telling you, this person going to be celebrating you guys. Yeah. There's a happy outcome here. Yeah, I'm seeing a lot of abundance here. This Empress, she is a, you know manifesting a lot of abundance here. She's somebody who's very sociable here. She have a lot of connections. And she's connecting with, you know, this person here. This could be like a past life connection here. But she's connecting here, guys. A divine connection. Yeah, she's about to get justice here. She's about to begin something new here in her life. This could be a new relationship. Yes, guys, I'm telling you. She she's with somebody who is very dear. You know, find her, you know, very dear to their heart. Yeah, I'm seeing an exchange here between you and this person. This person could be proposing here, guys. You know, you could be getting a ring here. There's definitely going to be some form of celebration here. I'm seeing some form of exchange here between you and this person. The six of the six of cups. You know, the two of pentacles. They see definitely see you as this earth angel here. And they're ready to make this new start with you. They're on the verge here. This is somebody who have gone through a transformation here, guys. They're waking up. They know what they want. They have eyes for you. They, they only have eyes for you. Yeah. They could have been dealing with, you know, the, this, a lot of deceptive people here. That's why this person is, like, protective, overprotective. Not say overprotective, they're protecting you, they're defending you, this Empress. You know, the Empress is already very strong here. She brings a lot of fire on her own here. You know, she, yes, I'm telling you. She's also a boss, a leader. The Ten of Swords. Now the Swords want to come out because I saw the Seven of Swords before. You know, there's like deception. Yeah, somebody's trying to sabotage here. They've been watching and waiting for the wrong, the right time. But this person is under God here. Whether this is this Empress or this person that you're dealing with here. Yeah. You've gone through this transformation here. You ended something with the, the Death Card and the Ten of Swords here. You closed out the cycle here, guys. Something ended here. You got justice. And we have the Queen of Cups. Yeah, this, I see a relationship, a new relationship that you're connecting with somebody. Where well, you guys are growing closer here. This connection is getting stronger here. You turn this person on here without even trying, guys. They're so amazed by you. They're ready to move forward. Yeah. They're ready to move forward with you. This is something they've been thinking about here. On a, you know, on an energetic level here. 
And now we have the Five of Swords. So I'm seeing this person is ready to move forward here, but there's somebody coming in trying to block this person from coming towards you. Are trying to block you. There's somebody here, guys. Because I saw the Seven of Swords before. Now we have the Ten of Swords, the Page of Swords. So this is somebody who's been watching here, waiting. You know, they want to try to sabotage you. They want to bring you down. They want to stop you from moving forward here. They don't want you to enter this new beginning here with this person. Yeah, they're standing there like a, a security guard here. Watching. Watching here. Trying to manipulate the whole situation. Yeah, this person could be working with other people. The three of pentacles here. You know, trying to achieve this. Yeah, but whoever this person you're dealing with, this is somebody who's like financially stable here. The four of pentacles, the queen of pentacles here. There's no way in hell they can stop this person. This person have authority. You know, they're very kind-hearted here. And she, this person is making time for those that they love. Yeah. You got this person confused here. They're in their head. You closed out something here. You ended something. Closed out a cycle here. That's why they're trying to fight you from moving forward or this person. Yeah, the world card. Exactly what I said. You closed out the cycle here with this person. Yeah. They're feeling left out here. Yes, I'm telling you guys. They're stressing out. They're filled with regrets now. They see your happiness. They see you moving forward here. You're coming into some form of... Yeah, look at this good fortune here the wheel of fortune is turning in your favor they can't stop it here it's right on top of this five of swords so whatever it is that's going on it, they've been shut down they closed out here they can't even open their mouth and speak they've been talking shit about you yes i'm telling you guys trying to fight you sabotage you but see the world is turning here the wheel is turning in your favor so I'm definitely seeing like a change of event here. Yeah, let's get one more card with this Wheel of Fortune. The Queen of Wands here. Yeah, so I definitely see somebody's definitely moving into their confidence here. The confident zone. Being confident. You know, not afraid to take action here. Yes, guys, this is a successful time for you here. The Queen of Queen of Wands is somebody who is like very beautiful, very sexy, naturally very hot. And this person, you turn this person on here, guys, without even trying here. <laughs> I'm telling you, you turn them on without even trying here. Let's get some oracles here, guys. I don't know what you did to this person here, guys. But they just can't get enough of you. You excite them. They're excited about you. Yes, I'm telling you. You turn them on in a big way. They themselves can't even explain here. How strongly, how deeply they feel for you. Empath. Could be dealing with an empath here. Mysticism. Faith. Yes, guys, your faith brought you through. Keep the faith here. Be strong. You know, it's right on top of the strength card. You're overcoming everything here with your faith completion here. I see somebody could have passed on here, guys. This could be a loved one. Yeah, but I'm seeing where they're watching over you. The spirit guides are watching over you, protecting you. Yeah, service. I see you're somebody who is like, you know, give service here, guys. It could be like a nurse, a doctor, somebody who's like a caregiver. But you give your service to others here. I'm telling you. And you're being rewarded here. You kept the faith. Destiny. This is your destiny. Yes, guys. Keep the faith here. You're about to move into your destiny. Your destined life. 
what you're destined for, your purpose here, guys. You're answering that call in here. You're giving your service here, guys. You could be connecting with spirit also. But this is your destiny, your soulmate. Wow. You're connecting with your soulmate here. I'm telling you. You're connecting with your soulmate. This could even be like at a funeral. Where somebody could have passed on and you meet this person here. Right after that. It's going to brighten up your days here. Quest. I see both of you are going on a new quest here. A new journey. Enlightenment. Yes, guys. You've been enlightening on your path here. Towards your destiny. You know your purpose. Both of you. Things are changing around here. Things are changing here. Your faith are moving mountain here, guys. The really amount of fight that you get. You overcome it here. Or this person. And you guys are coming together. You've definitely been enlightening here on your path here, guys. Yeah. Okay, guys. End of your reading. I hope this reading resonates with you. If it did, please give me that thumbs up, guys. Much appreciated. You know, take care of your beautiful self out there, guys. Yes? Love and light. <laughs>